So if you've got a young boy that's, you know, uh, expressing as a girl, he would go into the, the girls' school, the girls' class, and, I mean, poor young girls, it's, it's a sensitive topic enough, but they're going to sit there and they're going to talk in front of a boy about these sensitive things? It's, it's not, it doesn't seem right. Yeah, and more than that, remember, according to regulations in the state, teachers are not required to tell parents if their child changes gender identities, which is why we saw uh, about 100 parents come out yesterday uh, at the hearing. But the parents here told me they elected school board members to represent their values. Uh, the state maintains that its guidelines are misunderstood, though. Take a look at this. A statement from the New Jersey, New Jersey Attorney General's office reads in part, quote, to be clear, the state has never sought and will never seek a ban on parental notification. What the state won't do is require it. And that's something the attorney for the Marlboro School Board brought up yesterday in court.